This video shows basic experiments about surface finishing of mortar using some ultrasonic resonators. As shown in the followings, very low water content mortar can be liquefied that instance when an ultrasonic resonator is contacted with the mortar surface. Consequently, a dense layer is formed on the mortar surface. This compaction technology can be applied to manufacturing concrete products such as roof tiles, autoclaved light, weight concrete boards, and so on. First of all, let me show how the ultrasonic compaction phenomenon is. A cylindrical ultrasonic resonator make lumps of low water content mortar liquid. In consequence of liquefaction, the lump of mortar get one body with mortar in vicinity. The specifications of the ultrasonic resonator are vibration frequency of 28 kilohertz, vibration amplitude of 5 micrometer. The mortar is composed of ordinary cement, sand and water without any admixture. The person can't walk on the mortar immediately after the liquefaction test. When an ultrasonic resonator with frequency of 19 kHz amplitude of 11 micrometer travels on a mortar board in order to finishing surface, it shapes the mortar surface as if it were a plane for hardening mortar. At the same time, a dense layer is formed as shown later. The person can't walk on the mortar immediately after the first step surface finishing test. This part shows the secondary step surface finishing test for a smooth surface using the smaller amplitude resonator. This photo shows the section of the ultrasonically compacted mortar after the first step surface finishing. A dense layer has seen a thin white dry layer is formed. This photo shows two kinds of hardened mortar surface. The left one is after the first step and the right one is after the second step. Weak ultrasonic compaction at the second step has improved surface flatness of the mortar. The ultrasonic compaction is applicable to the following surface finishing processes. The first one is to extrusion process of concrete roof tile. A dense layer of roof tile surface can be formed by installing the ultrasonic resonator at an outlet port of an extrusion machine. Thus ultrasonically compacted dense layer has high resistance against raindrop soaking. The second applicable process is autoclaved light, weight concrete production process at cutting or slicing, which cut a huge concrete block into many boards, just after autoclaving. Using the ultrasonic cutter instead of the piano wire, both slicing and surface finishing can be performed at the same time. As a result, Flatness for easy painting can be obtained on both side surfaces of each ALC rectangular board. The last one is surface finishing on silica fume floor concrete at construction sites. That's all of this video showing.